We will be looking at Thermo Fisher business and some of the numbers, and then see too if the stock is worth owning in current market. We will cover all these points for better stock picking. Thermo Fisher closed at $574.82, with the decrease of negative 1.02% in the last trading session. Let's look at today's trend indicators. The moving average is bullish. Technical indication is in uptrend. And overall daily trend for the stock is in very positive trend. Looking at weekly analysis, the weekly stock trend is in very positive trend. Today's market fear in greed index is 64, which is indicating greedy emotion in the public sentiment. We usually look at this indicator to make our buy or sell decisions better. Thermo Fisher gave negative 0.83% returns in the last week, 6.41% in the last 30 days, and three months returns are 11.77%. Now let's have a look at simple moving average data. Moving average indicates that what could be the next footprint of the stock price in near future? 5-day average is 587 with a bearish indication. 10-day is 585 with a bearish indication. 20-day average is 568, which is a bullish signal. Let's look at fundamental analysis. We will mainly see the last two quarters of the company. In June 22, the revenue was $10,970 million. In the recent quarter, September 22, it declined to $10,677 million. Now let's see the profitability of Thermo Fisher. In the quarter June 22, the profits were $1664 million. And in the recent quarter, September 22, the profits declined to $1,495 million. Let's see debt numbers. Debt to equity number tells us how much the company is in debt. In the first quarter, it was 0.85, then it decreased to 0.81, then in third quarter, it again went down to 0.72. In the recent quarter, the debt score declined to 0.67. Generally, this ratio should not be over 2.0. This is today's buy or sell decision for this stock, which is purely based on the technical indicators. This is not a recommendation, but use this just as a guiding pointer for your stock picking.